Okay, boys, are you here? Yeah. Are you listening? Yeah. Genesis chapter 15, Jesus makes Abram righteous. Here, the word of the Lord visits Abram. The word of the Lord came to Abram and took him outside. And the word is a person. He's a he. And it's the word that would later become flesh. What does that mean, to become flesh? Come under our curse and be a human? Yeah. It doesn't just mean that the word is going to have a body one day, because he's already got one here. To take on flesh means he's going to join us with our battles against sin and death. So this word that visits Abram, who do you think he is? Jesus. Jesus. Before he later arrives in flesh, he's here with a body, and he's speaking to Abram. And he says, you're going to have a large family, you're going to become God's people, and through your family, the whole world will be saved. And Abram believed Jesus, and he became righteous. Boys, what does righteous mean? To be right with God. To be right with God. It means Abram became ready for heaven, sins forgiven, holy, friends with God. All good things that all of us need to have. Abram listened to Jesus and trusted him, his word, his promise, that he can save. And when he trusted Jesus, he became righteous. Trust has another word in the Bible. It's very similar. It almost means exactly the same thing. What do you think it is? Faith. faith. Abram had faith that God could save and make him righteous. And that's all it takes to become a child of God, a friend of God. Just trust him. Believe his promises. Even if we're ungodly, unkind, rude, unholy, sinful, he still can make us righteous. Just believe that he can do it. Trust it. So Abram becomes righteous, not because he loves God with all of his heart, because he hasn't been, or because he went a long time without sinning, because none of us can do that. Abram is made righteous because he trusts the Lord. Boys, your love for God is going to be up and down. It's going to come and go. It's important that you love God. But even more important than that is that you trust him, that the Lord loves you and can handle your day, whatever you're going through. Jesus makes Abram righteous. And he can make us righteous too.